welcome back to my channel so for today's video it's gonna be really an exciting one because for a long time I've been searching for the best vlogging camera that I could purchase myself um, it's actually between a Canon G7X Mark II or a Sony A5100 and just yesterday I've actually ended up buying a Canon G7X. So for today's video, we'll be unboxing the best vlogging camera that you could ever purchase. And if you want to know the details about it and the rest I've bought to go with it, then please keep on watching. Alright, so right now, if you guys are wondering what I've been using for the past videos that I've uploaded, I'm only using my iPhone 7 Plus. And actually right now still, I'm still using it because I'm still going to unbox the camera. So without further ado, let's start. So I bought everything yesterday from TV Hi-Fi. So here it is. So I didn't just bought the camera itself. I bought a tripod as well and the SD card because it doesn't come with an SD card. Here is the camera. So here is the box. This is how it looks like. So it said Canon PowerShot G7X Mark II. That's how it looks like. Yep. And it has all its details here. And the color and the code and everything. So let's open the box. Alright. So as you open the box, this is what it comes with so it comes with the Canon like post their poster or something I don't know so this one next is its warranty card yep and it's manual it's their manual right to the next section here let's get that box you can see the battery adapter the battery charger adapter the rechargeable battery yeah and the charger cord power cord there and the very last of course is its camera itself so the camera comes with this like styro like sleeve yeah so this is the camera and it comes with a sleeve as well so if you guys are wondering why is it attached already of course i've already opened up the box before i have think in this video to have it a little check and to know which is which and which is what and i've attached it as well so this is how the camera looks like yep there so it has its flip screen and you can tilt it down or up so whichever footage you're getting so if you're like taking a low one or a high one so you can see the screen so you can see which one have uh, which one you've captured so I'm just gonna put the battery on so I can turn it on for you guys so I already attached the battery so that is its power button there so i'm just gonna press that and yep yahoo you have it said there set date and time so i'm gonna do that now so i already did that so it's the 9th of april and it's already 3 30 p.m here in australia so i'm just gonna press set and we're in so set time zone so i'm in australia so I'm just going to put Sydney, but I'm from Brisbane. And ta-da! That's the camera. So it's on now. So this camera has 20.1 megapixels. It is 24 millimeters wide and 4.2 times. It's Wi-Fi certified, so 
you can actually um, Bluetooth your photos through your phone so you, you can upload it straight away to your social media accounts without even connecting it to a home computer or a laptop. So that's really very easy to use. So this camera is also a touch screen. So as you can see here. So with this one, I put it on a video setting already. So it has this choices which says standard, short clip, manual, time lapse, or I frame movie. So I'm still gonna play with this, yeah. So you can sh use this button here to zoom. And then this one here to change the focus. Yeah. So I'm, I'm just going to set this aside. I'm going to show you the other accessories I bought with it. And I'm going to show you a preview of how I look like using the camera itself. And I forgot, if you guys are wondering how much I bought the Canon G7X, I bought it for 840 Australian dollars in JB Hi-Fi. If you guys are curious about that. So I got the I got it with a Gorilla Pod, a Joby Gorilla Pod. What size is this? The 1K kit. I don't know if that's the size, but there's a bigger one than this. This is like the smallest, I think. So I got this for $49. So we're going to unbox this one too. Alright, so as you open it, you can see the manual here. So how to use it, everything, how to adjust, how, you know, such and such. And then, I don't know what's that. And then the pod itself, the Gorilla Pod. So I found out, like mostly of the YouTubers are using this thing. And I do really think... That's why they use it because it's very useful and it's very safe. So if you, whenever you can find like a steel or somewhere, you could just tangle this gorilla pod. So like how this picture shows or this one here. So I think it's really very accessible and very useful. So. If you want to take shots or if you're just by yourself and you want to take a video, you can just tangle it in a steel bar or like a wood or something and then you can take a perfect video for yourself. So I think that's why mostly of the vloggers or YouTubers are using the Gorilla Pod. So as I've mentioned a while ago, the camera didn't come with a memory card. So I bought them myself a memory card. The SanDisk one, 64 gigabyte. I actually tear it apart because, <laughs> as I've said, I've already opened the camera and have a little play with it. So, if you guys don't know, I'm a person that's really very clumsy. So what I do when I got home, I open the memory card straight away and put the card itself on the camera so I won't lose it because I'm really clumsy so I don't want to um, get into that <laughs> when that happened so I already did so this one cost me $56.95 with my camera I didn't bought a carry case or, or like a bag because I knew for sure that I'm just gonna hold it in my hand because for sure if I travel I'm gonna take videos on anything like I don't want to miss anything for you guys to see so I'm just gonna attach the gorilla pod through my camera and I'm gonna like compare the the view on the on just using a iPhone camera and the Canon G7X so I'm just gonna attach it okay so you guys may be wondering like I'm I'm not a famous YouTuber. I don't I barely even have a view. I barely even have subscribers and why did I bought myself a camera? 
Um, it's not really about the subscribers. It's not really about the views for me. It's about me doing something that I really like. And that something is making videos, editing, um, capturing moments. And sharing it with you guys is already a bonus. And having some subscribers, having some views is also like a big, big additional already. But it doesn't really matter. So if you guys are wondering why I bought myself a camera at this stage, at this early, it's because I want to make content that's really very good in quality, in terms of quality. And also to have the best um, captured memories. So with that, I do think I need a camera. And it's something that I dream of. It's something that I've worked hard. So I'm really happy. What's important is that I'm happy and um, it's gonna be worth it. So I'm gonna turn it on now. And this is the record button, so I'm gonna press it now. So you guys might see my pores and everything. <laughs> so if you guys are wondering what light I'm using or whatever, I'm not using anything because I'm just using a natural lighting. Because I'm still thinking of um, getting myself a ring light. But not, not now, not so soon. Because I don't think I need it now. So I'm just going to extend this. So this is how it looked like. So, as, as I searched through YouTube and comparing this one with the Sony A5100, the thing that the, the rest, of, like mostly all of the YouTubers are saying, is that this one focuses faster. It focuses faster than the Sony A5100. So for me, that's a big thing already. That's why I bought this. So that's my setup too. <laughs> Of the iPhone yeah so there you have it guys I think it's really really nice it's it my f you can see my face clearly you can see the surroundings clearly and of course I'm just gonna turn it off okay so I just turned off the camera I'm gonna use this one for the rest of the video um, if you guys also are wondering why I really bought that camera because I'm gonna do my first travel vlog very 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 soon so I think it's really nice that I have that so that it's gonna be very accessible and so that I can take very really I mean really good shots really good shots yeah because it's gonna be hard too for me if I'm gonna just use my mobile phone because I need it to check my social media accounts and everything and it's gonna be very very hard for me as well in terms of battery life because you know um, social media is life <laughs> and it's gonna well I have a big um, storage on this one but I think it's really a big difference having your own camera your own vlogging camera so also I have many videos um, coming up this next two months next two or three months um, I just did the unboxing first because I really want to do um I mean I really want to use that for the next videos that are online on my on my calendar or my planner so I hope you guys enjoyed the video today I hope you guys learned something um if you want to start YouTube it's not really an obligation for you guys to buy a camera straight like don't, you don't really need a camera straight away you can use your mobile phones that's what I use for videos that I've had i've had posted on my youtube but it's your choice it's um your willingness to get, to get the camera you don't have to buy it if you don't have enough you know uh, money or whatever you, you you should not force yourself or your parents to get you one so just whenever you can when you have the budget then go for it you know and also for this video i'm gonna have a haul a little haul just a mini haul i mean this stuff are given to me by my sister it's her early birthday gift for me because on my birthday uh we're gonna be away 
um, and she didn't want to wait that long. Well, because my birthday is still on the 20th of May, she gave this to me, I think, last week. So it's like very, very, very early. It's not even a month early. Um, more than a month. Um, she gave this to me because she wanted me to use this on our vacation and also for her upcoming debut. So, so she gave me two sets of Morphe brushes. I don't know what's the name or whatever, but let's just open this. So this one has its case here. It's red and yeah, it's really very birthday-ish kind. It's red. I don't know which, what is this for, but I think it's a mixture of powder brushes and eye brushes. Yeah, because this one's like a big powder brush and then there's an eyeliner brush, eyebrow brush. It's a mixture of two. So that's the first brush set she gave me. She also gave me this one here, which she said is a contour brush set. And also, uh, Morphe gave us... Um, what do you call this one? A trio or something of their new Morphe Eyelid Primer. So the red one is 8P set. This one is 6P set. So that's their Morphe brushes. It's very cute because it's um, very simple and classy at the same time with its wood, uh, white wood thing and then a uh, silver steel one. And and I don't have Morphe brushes. I only have those drugstore brushes. And I'm just so happy. And a backstory also. I was sleeping this time when she gave me this. She just had me the box. And I'm like, what? What is this? And you know when you just woke up and you're like very moody or something. And then she was just laughing at me. And then when I opened the box, this came straight. The Jaclyn Hill palette. So a backstory, she she knew for a fact or she knew for a very long time that I wanted to get myself the Jaclyn Hill palette. But it I don't know what hinders me not to get it. Maybe because I'm thinking that I'm not gonna use it or I'm thinking that it's just too much to get. I don't know. But it doesn't matter anymore. She bought me this one for my birthday. I'm, I'm the happiest girl in the world. And for the fact that I love doing surprises for my family, like I I love to surprise them. I, I love to surprise everyone that's close to me. And it's like, I think this is like the second time I've only been surprised my whole life. And she knows as well that I love getting surprises, of course. And, um, She's the sweetest. <laughs> so let's open up the Jaclyn Hill palette. So it comes with this bubble wrap thing. So I find it good for them that they, they place it on a bubble wrap because you'll never know the parcel when they pass it to the truck, they pass it to, you know, it might just ruin. So this one is a really good idea. When we travel, I'm, I for sure will gonna put that bubble wrap on this one because I don't want to ruin this when I'm going to use this for her birthday. So this is the Jaclyn Hill. Outside is like a summary or a preview of the shades. And then when you open it, ta-da! It's really, really nice. You know why I love this? Because it has mostly all of the neutral colors and some pop colors, which are this ones and the shimmery ones it's just perfect it's like an everything like a go-to eyeshadow one because you have everything here you don't need any other else palette because i think you're gonna find it from this palette yeah it's really too early it's not even my birthday month yet but thank you thank you so much if you're watching this my little sister i love you um right so that's it for the for the video i hope you guys have learned something and i hope you guys i've given you an idea of what you can get from buying a canon powershot g7x mark ii so if you really want to vlog and you want to take really good videos or good shots i recommend 
getting this one because from the videos I saw from the sales lady that I've talked to in the shop, she really, really said that this is the best vlogging camera. A compact one, of course, not those big DSLR ones, but the best compact mirrorless camera. So if you want to really, if you're really planning to get the camera, I'm recommending this one. So <laughs> that's what I can say, but I don't know the other features yet. I only have said that it is the best one. I have only said that you can, you should get this one because of all the reviews I saw on other YouTubers. So if you guys want to check their videos, if you want to search them, go ahead, search yourself. And I'm going to tell you, they're going to tell that you should get a Canon PowerShot G7X Mark II. So that's it for today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't to. Um, give this video a thumbs up and comment through the section box below for the stuffs you wanted me to, to cover or to make a video. Um, I'm just so sure that there's many vlogs or many video coming up for you guys for the next two or three months. And watch out for my first travel vlog also. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks! Bye!